couple days ago I had someone ask what was the best way to put a worm on the hook when you're fishing for bluegill and so today I'm going to try to demonstrate that. I have here a baby night crawler and I have a size 6 hook and I'm going to give this a try. Now, this isn't necessarily the best way to do it um, but it's the way I've used for a long time and it seems to have served me well. I'm going to go ahead and put the hook into the worm just behind the point and they usually squirm around a little bit when you first poke them and make it difficult for you. Once you get inside the worm, go ahead and push the worm onto the point of the hook, keeping the point of the hook inside the worm until you push the worm around the end of the hook a little bit and then go ahead and bring the hook out the side of the worm and then it's going to look something like this. Now you could leave the entire worm on the hook. If I was fishing for bass I might do that. But since I'm fishing for bluegill I'm going to go ahead and just pinch the worm in half. There's really no reason to put the whole worm on. It just wastes the worm because the fish will continue to, to bite and chew it off and you won't be able to actually get them hooked until they get it chewed clear up to here and, and get up to the hook. So uh, I just use half a worm. If it's a pretty large night crawler you can even use a third or a fourth of the worm and toss it out there and see if you can pull in a fish. If you have any questions or have some other suggestions, uh, feel free to leave a comment. And as always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.